All right, here we go. So just a quick shuffle. So okay, so I'm playing. Uh, who am I playing? I'm playing the wasp. I'm playing the collector. The first scenario, uh, which is called. Shuffle this one. So this is the collector's deck. Had a good shuffle before, but ooh, just had a little alert come up on my phone. Getting my Star Trek game today. That's exciting. Okay, so I will now draw six cards. Oh, those are a bit sticky. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's check that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Yeah. Right. I'm making a mess of things here. All right. So let's have a look. Okay, so rapid growth, um, lion weight, into the fray, Thor, uh, Spider Man, giant help. Okay, I've got to have a bit of a think on this. Alright, so I decided that I'm going to basically keep these cards. So I guess I just laid them out. That might make sense. I uh, can't really see them. off the table anyway um, so with the setup I have to take this hot card off I'm assuming it's at this point whoops okay so wasp helmets is now in the collection okay uh, turn begins so basically I think what I'm doing is changing into tiny mode Tiny mode. All right, so she's in tiny mode now. So one, one, two. Has a response. Yeah. If I um, do a minion or a side sc scheme, I do a damage to a villain. So, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play. Right. Plus two for that. Right, okay, so I'm going to play Rapid Growth and I'm going to pay with that card. So basically, what I was going to do is I'm going to attack. So that's attack for one, but it's saying basically there's an interrupt. Let's have a look. When you use one of uh, your hero's basic powers, change to your giant hero form and get plus two so I'm saying attack changing into giant mode I can open it up there go. okay so it's two plus two so that's four so that's four off so that's down to nine right. so with events, they're not in play, so that does not go to the collective. That's how I interpreted the rules. Now, so she is tapped. Then, let's have a look. Um, I was going to do this one, wasn't I? So hero action. Remove three threat from a scheme. Remove a total of four threat. If you choose instead if you are in giant mode, which I am. So for that, I'm paying two. Mm. So it's gonna be those two fellows. Right, so I'm keeping that one. Um, so basically four threat. So I'm using um, 
this um, dice here for threat, so that says four, so I'm just taking it off the field because I just got rid of four threat. Okay, so not really much more I can do this turn, so and my turn, so I'm ready. So I'm gonna draw, so hand size of five, I have one card, so I'm gonna draw four cards. One, two, three, Wow, these are really sticky. Why are they so sticky? Nah. Uh, look at my cards quickly. I don't think there's anything that I can do. Ruins from correction. Aggression cards. Um, okay. Uh, okay, that could be good if a minion comes out. Uh, um, Okay, so it's the villain phase, so one threat on the main scheme, so that'll be one. Which I'll put here. Okay, so then uh, he attacks for one. Um, I'm not going to defend, uh, so I draw one card. So two, so he does three damage. Okay, so that eleven, so I lose three, so I'm on eight. Uh, do that. Okay, so then <coughs> encounter card treachery. Okay. Um, all right. Um, okay, so okay, put the highest cost card from your hand face up into the collective, or discard the highest cost card from your hand, then place threat on the main screen equal to the printed cost. Okay. Um, all right, so I worked it out. So basically, what I'm going to do is I've got two cards that cost three which is pinpoint strike and into the fray um, I'm gonna put into the fray into the collective that gets discarded um, so that was that okay so I never think now. okay um, worked out I'm gonna use this rapid growth but what I have to do first is um, change wasp into um, tiny mode. Yep. Then I will play. Uh, then I'm going to do an attack, but as a with the attack, I do an interrupt. Uh, so I initiate an attack. I do an interrupt, which is this one again. So I'm basically doing an attack. So I'll change back into giant, and I'll get plus two for that attack. Can use that card to pay for it. So the attack for us, I'm back into giant mode, and then he does another four damage. So that leaves it on five. One, two, three, four. Uh, so that was that. Okay, so and that will tap that out. Then that will be the end of the turn. I will draw three cards. One, two, three. Okay. All right. So villain phase. First of all, threat. So there's one on here at the moment. So I might add a two. So it's two threat. <sighs> okay. So then he attacks. Um, yeah, not going to defend. So what do I get? Oh, it's got a boost icon on it. Okay, so what's this say? Oh, it's a boost. If there are three or fewer cards in the collect and collection, put the top card of your deck face up in the collection. I think there's only two in there, so I have to do that. So that was the boost effect. Oh, okay, so he did... All right, so he did one damage, just his base attack... Uh, so that puts me on seven. Um, and now I have to, yeah, it's two cards in the collection. 
Um, so I've got a discard top card, Ant Man. So three cards there now. That sucks. All right. So that was that. Now let's see encounter phase. Okay. So uh, so we know this one. So when revealed as a hero, the villain attacks you. So again, I'm not going to defend. He attacks for one. So he does three damage. So it's on seven. So down to four and three. All right. So that's that. Okay, I think I've worked out what I'm going to do. So, first of all, I'm going to do pinpoint strike for three. One, two, three. Uh, so I'm going to get rid of that one because I'll get a, I'll get two health back from that one because there's a response. So heal two damage from your hero after you spend this card. Uh, so that's one, two, three. Let's keep that. Uh, so that's three. So deals. Okay, so I get my, I get two health back. So let's do that first. So I'm on six. All right. So kills the collector because he was on five uh, so he just she just did seven damage so some stuff happens okay so we'll get the collector to oh, where is it? Oh, there he is all right so that one's dead uh, so basically with this one uh, so basically yeah it's got to put a um a card in the collective again um, and the same deal about cards going in there, so that's the same essentially. He's just a bit stronger, so he's got 14 health. Okay, um, so I've got to put a card in the collection. So, uh, so how many have we got in there? All right, I'm gonna have to get rid of the card. Like this actually could be really bad. Okay, so that was that. So, attacking could kill, so I think, so I haven't used any action yet. Oh yes, okay, that's right. So, I'll use the action, which is on the scheme, which basically says I can do exhaust my hero, um, or spend two resources to discard one card from the collective. So, let's grab, it's not gonna matter. That man in there. Okay, so that was that. Then, haven't done any flipping over. I'm gonna go to um, her alter ego. Now I could potentially use this power. So, so they're the purple ones. Okay, so. Yeah, I've got a couple of cool purple ones there, so I'll use that resource. Uh, action doesn't say anything about exhausting, so I can just do that. So I'll shuffle that in. Sorry about that, that must have been very boring for you. <laughs> okay, so um, that was that. Yep, so end turn, draw up. So I'm keeping that, so I get six cards now, so I get five more. Uh, one. There, but I don't really have the resources for them, right? All right, so um, okay, villain turn begins. So, one, so that is now on three. Then he schemes, he schemes for three plus one, so four. 
So that is now on seven in total. So we'll go five, uh, six, seven. So I've got a five and a two on there that equals seven. So that was that. Then the encounter card, minion. Okay, so he's got guard and I can't thwart. Um, well, he's engaged with me. Okay, so let me get across it. We have so guard, so I have to kill him before I do any more damage on the collector. Uh, it's also got patrol, which means that while he's engaged with me, I can't take anything off the scheme, which is shit. So I have to kill him. All right, so I'll just put him there, I guess. Now, to remind me about guard, I'm just going to put the top symbol on the dial, so I remember that it's got guard. Okay, so that was all that. Okay, so my turn, I probably have to think. Okay, so I'm going to heal for three. That puts me on nine. Yep. Then I'm going to turn over, I think I think it was a tiny form, so she's still um, tapped. Um, so then I'll do that one. So I pay one for it. So surprise attack. Uh, so basically, um, so after I transform, I do all three damage, all four of using a brain resource. Not a brain resource, but it is enough to kill the minion because I have to kill him first. Okay, so I do that, so that goes into there. So there's now four cards there. All right, so I'm going to have to, unfortunately, Use two cards to buy one of those out. Um, I'll make it uh, I've got, uh, maybe I'll see them. Who knows? Oh, who knows? I overthink it. So, three cards. Yep. So, that was that. Don't want to play those. Can't do anything there, that tough simple's gone. Do that. Draw three cards. One, two, three. Let's have a look. Okay. Right. Yeah, sort of handy. Alright, so take a threat, so I'm on seven at the moment, so that goes to eight. Ten of its bust. Okay, so then he attacks for two, not gonna defend. So three damage. So back onto six. So that was that. Encounter card. Okay. Um so I'll actually let's bring it up to the camera, hey? Okay, hinder two, which means I put two on there, uh, in addition to the three. So there'll be five threat on it. When defeated, the player who defeated this scheme may heal four damage, so that's good. But in the meanwhile, I draw two extra um, encounter cards, which I've said before, doesn't happen now. I reckon it. Ha I reckon happens next time. That's what I think. Okay, so I've got to put five thread on that one. So three plus two. All right. So that was all that. All right. Yeah, I don't think this is going to end well. All right, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to pay pinpoint strike, so that cost me three money. Attack, basically I do eight damage, so I do it to the collector. So eight damage, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that puts him on six. I don't have enough resources to get him this turn. Um, so six, then 
then I should maybe should I should I get a card? Okay, so I just put the marker on there to remind myself to do two encounter cards. Okay, so <clears throat> I'm going to pay two energy to get rid of another card. Just don't want that blowing up in my face. So into the phrase back over there. So there's two cards there now. Uh, that card's staying in my hand. And I'm going to change to Wasp. Don't believe I've changed this turn. Okay, so then I'm going to thwart for two. Nothing's stopping me from doing that, I don't think. Uh, yep, so that makes that six. Okay, so then that's it. So I like that. Draw four cards. One, two, three, four. Let's see what I got. Yeah, okay, some good cards there. Okay, so one threat, so that's now on seven. He's now attacking. Um, yeah, let's think. Yeah, okay, so I've decided that I will defend. So he defends for three, so he attacks for two. Okay, so three, so that's not too bad. So in fact, I didn't get any damage at all, but he's tapped. Okay, so then the next thing is my first encounter card. <sighs> you bastard. Okay, seven bots, so he's basically got guard. That's sort of the main thing, so I'll put that there. Um, and the next one. All right, so what's this one do? Let's have a look. Okay, well, I don't like this card, so I've got to put him on the collector. So basically, anytime he does, I damage him. Instead, I delete, I get rid of this card, put it in the collection, uh, prevent damage, but then I put threat on the main screen, scheme equal to the amount prevented. Yikes. <laughs> All right, well, okay. So she's tapped because she defended. Um, so I'm going to change forms. I'm going to change to tiny so it's still tapped i'm going to play that as a response um after you change form deal three damage to an enemy so i'm going to use that card to pay for it so basically going to get rid of the servant bot so that kills that oh when it goes there so there's three cards in there okay um so that was that okay yeah, don't know what the best move here is, but um, that's pretty much it for my move. So I end my turn. So I draw two cards. So I heart. Um, so they're not really helpful, I don't think. Okay, so this could be the end. So one scheme. So that puts it on to eight. Okay, then attack. I'm not going to defend this time. Eight, so two. Oh, so he's got three in it. So that's five. Oh, I'm fucked. Five. So I'm down to one. Uh, so that was that. Um, then, yeah. The first encounter. Attached to your okay, let's look at this closer. Okay, so attached to your identity, attached character gets minus 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 hero action, take a damage, and spend those resources to discard this card. What card. Have one health. Anything that does anything to my health, I am done. Okay, now it looks like I'm alright. So, okay, so when revealed, you are confused. If you're already confused, take a damage. I'm not confused, thank goodness. 
So that's good. Uh, let's see if I got this right. So I think what I need to do is go over to that mode um, into giant mode. Then she will do an attack. So she actually gets minus one attack because of this. So it's normally two, but it needs to be one. So it actually works really good. So because of the attachment here, basically instead this card gets discarded into the collection and whatever damage was done, a threat gets added. So uh, it's now on nine. All right, okay, that's cool. All right, so that was that. Then, um, so that's tapped. Then all I've got to do, right, is that one, which is pinpoint strike. Attack, deal seven damage to an enemy. If you're in tiny mode, doesn't matter, I'm in giant mode. So I pay three, so let's say uh, those three cards. Seven damage, and that is game winner. Okay, very good.